Hey y'all, hey, Amanda here, and today for some reason I just felt super compelled to do a plan with my video. Was just in the mood for it. And I think I'm going to be using some stickers from Two Little Bees that I just got in the mail, so I think that's what I'll base the layout around. And, uh, yeah, super excited. <coughs> I'm thinking of maybe keeping the bubbles over here. I haven't decided. I'm going back and forth. I think I want to put this down here. This is new. I got this at Tuesday morning in a two-pack. So, I really like this houndstooth washi. I think it's just precious. currently Sunday morning right now. What are you guys up to? I've already been to Target. I planned on going to Target anyway and then I got on Instagram before I got out of bed and realized it was the uh, Lily for Target day. And someone had posted some super cute mugs so I thought eh, maybe I'll look for them on the off chance they're there. When I left my Target there was officially one necklace and one phone case left in that collection. And they were like taking down the displays. It was hilarious. I was like, oh, guess I should have a uh, rose with the chickens, I suppose. So, yeah, that was a fail, but I did get some cute new stickers they put out in the dollar section. The gold alphabet stickers, so I was excited about that. Yeah, I'm probably, I probably get more excited about the dollar spot stuff than the collaborations, and especially, like, and Lily Pulitzer, it's not really my jam. I mean, I think the items are beautiful, but <clears throat> I'm not, like, obsessed with them. I do think there are some gorgeous prints, but I think they're really overrated and overpriced for what they are, personally. And I read this Refinery29 article. It was, like, all these people bitching, like, that lowers the value to putting it in Target. How? Why would they do this? Lily's turning over in her grave. And I'm like, y'all, seriously, it's not that high end. It's a $200 dress, not a $1,000 dress. Like, calm your asses down. It's not that high end. I think I'm going to work around this sheet. Because that's super cute. <clears throat> so I'm going to be needing something to write my hours on for work. Let's see. Maybe there's a washi I can lay down for that. Maybe this one? Is that too green? I don't know, that might be cute to lay down that here. And I also have these new page flags. So let's see how that might look. Oh, actually, that might be really cute. Are these the same color? Can you tell? I have no idea. Hmm. I don't know. What should I do? Oh, so confusing. <coughs> hmm. Maybe I have something else in my arsenal I can use. So what are we thinking? Page flag or washi? I, I kind of want to use the page flags just because they're new, and I just got them, so let's go ahead. Still not sticky, just in case y'all were wondering. Go ahead and size that up. You know, I think I'm just going to put some a glue stick on it, and then I'll just chop the non-sticky end off with my uh, ruler. Just rip it off. <clears throat> one down. A few more down. Maybe I'll hold one to those just in case I decide to do something with them. So, did any of you guys actually go to the Lily Pulitzer launch? 
stand in line early in the morning and get anything. I would love to hear about like the quality of the products. I'm very curious how they uh, turned out because the prices were very reasonable. I really wanted to get the mugs after I saw them on Instagram this morning. I didn't actually like look into the line just because that's a lot of work. <laughs> and I'm not the biggest fan, but uh, yeah. Austin's still in bed, so I'm trying not to be too loud. It's days like this where I like wake up and don't feel like making breakfast, and he sleeps in a little late, that I really like try and scheme to get him to take me to brunch. I freaking love brunch. Brunch breakfast is my favorite meal ever. So, I really enjoy going out for it. I'd much rather go out for brunch than for like a dinner, lunch. I don't know why. I just, I really like breakfast food. I wouldn't say breakfast foods, any breakfast foods are my favorite foods, but I do really like them. What are you guys' favorite foods? I would love to know. You should leave that in a comment down below. Top three. If I had to pick my top three right now favorite foods, it would be pepperoni pizza, guacamole, and miso soup. Kind of a strange combination there. I'm sure I'm not the only one with a weird combination of favorites, so let me know down below what yours are. Oh, that one's like not all the way. There we go. Get all OCD. I actually, I really like the way that these look. I'm glad I went with these over the washi because I think they're super cute. And these are the new page flags that are trickling their way out across the country at the moment. I have managed to find, I think, three in total of these packs. So they're either not sending a lot to the stores or people are really sniping them out quickly. So, just keep an eye out for them, because chances are, once they do get put out, they won't be around for long. Unless you're like someone who lives in an area where you're the only person that's into this stuff, and lucky you, sort of. I mean, you have no one to relate to, but you can tear up your target. So, here are the... Well, stickers? Let's see. Hmm. Maybe I'll write out some stuff first. Oh no, where's my black Stedler pen? It's MIA. That makes me sad. I need to find that. I can use a Sharpie pen for now. Let's see. What? No work. <clears throat> hmm, so I have two meetings and an appointment today, so that's three things. Or not today, this week. I guess I could use those little hearts to mark them off. I need to find my black set pen right quick. I don't like writing on the pages with the Sharpie pen because it bleeds through, so I prefer writing with the Stedler one because it doesn't bleed through. Surprise, surprise. So, let's see here. Yeah. Hmm. I think I'm going to use this little buddy. Oh, oh, no, the heart peeled off too. I'll use that heart in a minute. I'm going to use this right here to mark payday. Uh, 
And then I'm going to put a little heart over on Monday morning. Oh, that is crooked as all hell. Oh, goodness. Please peel off easily. Okay, good. It is so hard to place these tiny stickers straight. Because I can't really see what I'm doing with my chubby ass fingers putting it down. Okay, that's good enough. So, let's see here. 2015 goals. Do your Sharpie pens get all over your hands like that? Do you see that? It's disgusting. 30. <clears throat> and I have another meeting on Tuesday at work. Put a little. Oh, that's crooked. There we go. Then I have a haircut on Friday. I wonder if any of these haircut stickers in the back are like the right color. Hair appointment. Oh, it's pink. That might look okay. What do you guys think? Let's try it. I can't get this off with one hand. There we go. Let's see here. Yeah, I think the pink will look okay. Yeah. Cute hair appointment at 6.15. Okay. Yeah, I don't hate that. That's cute. And then I've got all these little checklisty things. I know I want to put one of these on Saturday. And I think I'll put one on Sunday. My weekends are really when I hit the to do lists hard. Maybe I'll put this one down here. Cute. And these stickers did arrive with a shiny finish, a glossy finish, but I had custom requested them to arrive in a matte finish. And I guess she, the store owner, realized after she sent them, so she's sending me a whole new pack of all the stickers I ordered in a matte finish, which is awesome. I think that's really awesome that she caught that and that she's going to uh, replace them for me. It's super sweet. I think I'm going to put this little heart and cross bows here on the corner. That looks cute. And I guess I'll just fill in with these boxes wherever. Oh, I need to put my TV shows in. Let me grab some TV stickers. I think I have little purple TVs. Yeah, I have purple TVs from Lily Henry. So, let's see. What, what on earth have I been watching? I don't even remember. Um, oh, there's Real Housewives. I oh, know Real Housewives of Beverly Hills is Dunzo. Uva. These are bothering me. I need to take them off. I know I still have Survivor going on. And my Real Housewives of Atlanta. Oh. No, don't be crooked, please. Let's see what else. That's over. Shaw's, I kind of just, I've stopped watching on that day, and I kind of just catch up on demand whenever, because it's baseball season, so I just let Austin take control of the moat most of the time. But these are definitely the two shows 
I am watching when they air. What is Nini's problem lately? Have you guys been watching that? She just doesn't want to like tackle issues at all. She's very much being kind of a brat, but um, whatever. That's Nini. Let's see. What else do I have to mark off? I kind of like that I left this. I think it looks really cute. I'm digging that. I guess I'm just gonna fill in with these cute little decorative boxes wherever. Or I might even wait until I actually get into using the spread and then fill in where I don't fill in any other detail. And I'm sure I'll have more lists of things to put in. And we'll probably eat out at some point, so I'll use that sticker. I think I want to put one of these here. To remember to submit my hours for work, because I always forget. Always forget. So I have to remind myself. Okay. Sorry, my handwriting is not the cutest at all. Let's see if there's any other cutesy little elements I can add. I'm just going through my treasure trove of stickers right now. Like, whoo, hello, stickers. All up in my grill. Any cute little purple words I want to add? Not celebrating anything. Meh, don't want to add any of those. Too, but I've kind of put a flower on both of the last two spreads. So maybe not. I cannot wait for our vacation this summer. Our vacations this summer. One vacation we go camping and then go to Hershey Parks. I've got like the camping stuff and the amusement park stuff. And another vacation we go to the beach. I've got a couple of beach ones too. I'm really excited to use those. There um, are some really cute stickers, I think, from Paper Love. They're like little anchors and stuff. I want to get them to mark on the days when we go out on the boat at the beach. I just thought that would look really cute. Maybe I'll put this cute little feller down. Hmm, maybe like over here. Yeah, that's cute. Purple star anywhere? Maybe I'll put the purple star down too. Oh, I ripped it. I need to be a little more gentle. Put the purple star over the goals and notes words because they're just not even important. That's cute. And these are Sticko brand stickers. How do you guys organize your stickers? I would love to know this. This first um, Target thing I have, I've organized it first by like words and numbers, so that, all that stuff. Spring, summer, fall, seasons, and then shapes, animals, random. I want to know how you guys do it, and I think I'll probably do a video on this eventually once I'm a little more organized, but I would love to know how you guys are doing your sticker organization, because that would be super helpful. the shapes. Let's see if there's any cute little animals that might look cute on this spread. Mm, I'm not feeling any of them this week. The Lily Henry ones are really cute. I've got like a thousand and one of these Dollar Tree owls. Um, maybe him. He might look cute on this spread. We'll see. Yeah. Put 
these away. I have a tab that says animals, which is a complete lie. It should really just say owls. Because, except for like these little birds and butterflies, the, that's the only animals I have is owls. Because I love owls. I'm kind of obsessed with them. If you guys were to ever visit my apartment, which I'm not sure why you would be, unless we became biffles, but uh, yeah, you'd see I have owls freaking everywhere. A little bit obsessed with them. It's cute. And I'm back in there. Anything from here? I like this unicorn. We'll finish this out and put this silly little unicorn down here. Because that's just funny. So this is kind of a random week, but I like the way it's turning out. fill in with these boxes as the week goes. So the only thing missing from this spread are my baseball stickers. But um, I don't really know when the O's are playing. I usually ask Austin what days the games are and he just tells me when I have them in. But uh, you know, I'll just grab my phone and do this. Googled the Orioles schedule. Full schedule. Okay. Oh, no, I didn't want to hit shopping. Full schedule. So let's see, starting on the 20th. Wait, the 20th is an 11 a.m. game on a Monday? That's weird. But, uh, whatever, I'll put the ball in. In the morning. Okay. The 21st is a 7 p.m. game, so we put it down here. The 22nd is also a 7 p.m. game. And the 23rd is also a 7 p.m. game. No surprises here. Then the 24th is 7 p.m. game. I don't know if I'm the only person that does this. I don't know. I just like keeping track of the games. I really like baseball. And then the 26th is an afternoon game. Since I have my checklist there, I'll put this up in the morning. Okay, so that kind of cuts down the number of days where we can put the cute boxes. There's one, two, three, four, five, six spots left. And there's only four boxes, so... Hmm. Maybe I'll just put these four boxes, like, in the middle sections during the week. Yeah, that'll be cute. To be honestly, not a ton of on during the week. Beyond my work schedule, which usually fits in the first box up top anyway. I mean, if I have an afternoon meeting, yeah, I'd probably put it in the middle box, but during the week it's mostly work and home. And not a ton in between. This is cute. And then I'm going to put this one that has room for writing on Thursday because we will likely do more on Thursday. Or you know what, maybe I won't. Maybe I'll put this on Saturday. Yeah, I think I'm going to put this on Saturday. Yeah, that looks really cute, don't you guys think? 
And then I'll add these lists in, maybe here and here. And then I've got this cute little flag to still use. Hmm. We'll see how these get used up. But I think I'm going to leave them on here for now until I actually go throughout like utilizing this for my week. And uh, yeah, I'm really liking the and, way. Um, I think that's it. I kind of like how it's looking. I printed little to do, like little um, arrows that say to do. So I think I'm going to glue them on above the places where I have the checklist. But I don't have them with me right now, so, so that'll have to go on. You'll have to see that next week when I review the spread. But that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really like how this spread turned out. I think it's super cute. This might be my favorite one from April. It might be because of the simplicity. I really liked that I left that. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. So if you guys enjoyed this spread too, then give me a thumbs up. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. If you'd like to stick around for a while, you can hit that subscribe button. And be sure to check out all of my recent videos. I have an Ipsy bag video, a Birchbox video, a Target haul, and then I also have a few more Target hauls because I'm obsessed and can't stop shopping on my Instagram. So be sure to go down in the bottom bar and find that link as well. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!